Today we're doing the Galgate's nerve block technique. The nerves anesthetized are the inferior alveolar, mental, incisive, lingual, mylohyoid, auriculotemporal, and the buccal in 75% of patients. The area is anesthetized mandibular teeth to midline, buccal mucoperiosteum and mucous membranes on the side of injection, anterior two-thirds of the tongue and floor of the oral cavity, lingual soft tissues and periosteum, body of the mandible, inferior portion of the ramus, skin over the zygoma, posterior portion of the cheek, and temporal regions. Our technique today will be using a 25 gauge long needle. Alignment requires that the needle be aligned with the lower border of the tragus. The correct landmark is the center of the external auditory meatus. Alignment Align the needle with the plane extending from the corner of the mouth to the intertragic notch on the side of injection. It should be parallel with the angle between the ear and the face. Align the needle with the plane extending from the corner of the mouth to the intertragic notch on the side of injection. It should be parallel with the angle between the ear and the face. Direct the syringe towards the target area on the tragus. Intraoral landmarks are the height of injection established by placement of the needle tip just below the mesial lingual, mesial palatal cusp of the maxillary second molar. Penetration of soft tissues just distal to the maxillary second molar at the height established in the preceding step. The orientation of the bedival is not critical. As normal, you would prepare your tissues at the site of penetration by drying with gauze and applying topical anesthetic. Slowly advance the needle until bone is contacted. Bone contacted is the neck of the condyle. The average depth of penetration is 25 millimeters. If bone is not contacted, withdraw the needle slightly and redirect. Move the barrel of the syringe somewhat more distally thereby angulating the needle tip anteriorly and re-advance the needle until bony contact is made. At this point, you'll withdraw the needle approximately one millimeter, aspirate, and inject 1.8 milliliters over 60 to 90 seconds.